hi guys welcome to only match tutorial point today we are going to discuss topic called tally marks that is in statistics question number one from the frequency distribution by taking a suitable class interval for the following data gives the ages of ages of 52 employees in a government agency okay this is the data of 52 employees who are working in government agency okay their ages were 67 34 36 48 49 so on okay up to 52 observations they gave here they are asking to find the data using tally marks okay now to, so before going to do this sum first of all we need to find the range guys so what is the least value in the given observations what is the least value in the given observations 28 is the least value and 16 is the upper value okay the greatest value therefore if you do the difference between these two we get 41 we get that is nothing but range guys so what is the what is this range so we got 41 as range right so if we take the class intervals of size 5 then we get 9 classes because 9 into 5 in near to 45 okay so if you take class interval of size 10 we get 4 classes 4 to 5 okay so that is the concept of range guys okay now here in this in this situation we got range as 41 we are taking class intervals of 5 means the difference between the two groups upper boundary and lower boundary is 5 therefore we get 9 classes because 9 into 5 is 45 so that number is near to 41 right now so take a tablet form using frequency distribution first of first of first right first heading as ages second heading as tally marks third one number of employees so first heading is ages second way tally marks third column is number of employees we call it as frequency case now we took 5 5 gap right so first start from 25 25 to 30 35 to 30 to 40, 35 35 to 40 45 to 50 so like that you write up to 65 to 70 case the class intervals so total we have 9 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and the difference is 5 okay now how we got it this tally marks so you, you need to make a note that what are the ages between 25 to 30 guys so 25 to 30 1 2 3 4 5 25 to 30 means you don't include 30 guys so in this uh, class interval so we should take up to 29 so what we get 28 is one observation 29 2 then 28 3 third observation 28 fourth observation okay now that one i mentioned here 4 so similarly 30 to 35 30 to 34 okay so don't include that upper boundary so 30 to 34 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 sorry up to 34 right 10 10 guys okay so like that you need to write you need to uh, find out all the ages which are lying in the given data okay so these vertical bars are generally called a tally marks okay this is a, this is how we represent the raw data into some meaningful data meaningful data why it is called meaningful data means we we use class intervals here so class intervals act as a groups therefore it acts as a 
actual data. We converted ungrouped data into grouped database. Okay. I hope you understand this. Sir. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos and for more updates. Thank you.